people were having a problem regarding maven installation in vs code so i found a solution simple solution what you need to do is proceed sequentially so the first step in setting up your entire java workflow is downloading a java jdk now in google search bar just type java jdk and hit enter click on the first link and here you will see that for your specific operating system it is there but i will select the java 17 version because this is the long term support version which everyone is using it is industry standard it is used in so many companies and it is supported until i think uh, 2029 so java 17 is the way to go so click on this java 17 and you may notice three operating systems linux mac os and windows i am using the windows operating system then you need to click on this and just download the 64 bit installer click on this download button and the download will start immediately i have downloaded the software which i want to show you right this this is the software just double click it and install it as usual simple now this is the first step the moment you do this what will happen is in the environment variables just click on this environment variables and you will see a path like this this will be the path that will be added in your environment variable for the system okay now you don't have to tinker with this entire thing we just need to go to here where i need to click on new and type like this java underscore home java underscore home like this and the variable value will be the installation directory for the, our jdk now open up your windows explorer c drive and go to program files then java jdk 17 and this is it just select this much and uh, just paste it here in the variable value i have already added here so i don't need to do that just click on ok and just click on ok close this window and now open a new tab now type maven apache so i'm going to install the apache maven installer that is go to this download button here you will see a binary zip archive which you will need in your windows operating system just click on this download button and it will be like this if you extract it will like this and inside of it you will see the bin folder in which you have the mvn.cmd file now i will go to my vs code workflow now the main process starts vs code has not seen about whatever your java jdk is or whatever your operating system is vs code doesn't know that so in order to get your java running inside vs code you need to install their extensions now i have already installed it but you need to only install these extensions after installing the jdk not before that okay now click on this extension tab and uh, type like this java and uh, you will see the extension pack for java just install it now press ctrl shift p on your keyboard and type maven you will see a create maven project button click on this and you will see a button right here an archetype which contains a sample maven project so i will click on this button now i will select the latest version of the maven archetype so i will select the 1.4 I will keep the group ID as usual. You can use any of your uh, group ID of your choice and also the artifact ID. Click enter. Now 
uh, select the folder in which I want to store my Maven projects. Now click on new folder, Java Maven projects like this. Now click on this folder, go inside of it and select the destination folder. Now you will see that the Maven execution or the Maven project creation has started. Wait for a while. Now the moment you see that define value for property version 1 snapshot, you just click on this uh, terminal and hit enter on your keyboard and it will ask you to confirm properties configuration just type y for accepting the configuration now hit enter on your keyboard and that's it the project has been created now you may open up that project like this wait for a while to load up trust the authors just uh, close this window and now you can go to the source main and app.java you can click on this uh, run java command and it will open up a new terminal window which i have set it up now you may see that the output has been shown in my terminal window now close this now click on this maven right here just increase the window size now open up my demo project here you will see that i have dependencies plugins life cycles now if i want to for the first time you will see that this command right here so in order to execute that just the moment you click on this run icon then it will ask you to locate your maven.cmd file now you will browse that folder and just select this maven.cmd file that's it after that you can use this all these commands like clean validate compile all these commands you can use that and any dependency that you want to add in your java project and you can do that using this dependency so this is the full installation for your maven project thank you